Okay, so Make You Feel My Love, which was covered by Adele, originally written by Bob Dylan. It's got a, a lot of simple chords in it. It's pretty straightforward, but there is the odd chord, which you might never have uh, heard of. So I'm just going to tackle that first. So you've got a D with an F sharp in the root. So what that means is you've got a D chord, and then you've got to put an F sharp in the root, and it says use your thumb. So you see, you play your D. So with this song, it's probably intermediate, someone who's uh, actually all right with chords and open chords. And see this note on the top, the second fret, is an F sharp, so listen. Okay. So that's a D over F sharp. Then we've got an F chord. So you could do your standard F, but this one requires a, a bar on the first fret there. And it's that E shape. Uh, so that's an F. And then you've got a, a G over B chord, which basically is a G chord, but the over B means that the, the B has got to be the lowest note. So this first finger is a B note, so you can't be playing that as your lowest note and then playing this one, which is even lower. So you've got to take that off and you, you play from here. And you strum from the fifth string, so a good tip is to mute that top string, whether you use your thumb or I normally just use my finger to press up against the sixth string so that's a G over B and then we have I'm sure there's a C in this but then it goes to C minor so bar in the third fret and play an A minor chord I'm sure a lot of you know a B minor anyway on the second fret so a C sharp is just a step up C sharp sorry a C minor is just one step up Okay, so what other chords are on it? I'll just go through each section. So the intro, you got a G. D over F sharp, so the D with the thumb. And then an F, normal F. To a C. C minor. To a G. A7 for two bars, so to a D7 and then a G for four of these. So that is the bulk of the uh, the verses there. Apart from the end of this verse, where it's uh, I'll play the end of it, the A7 D7. To make you feel my and then there's G for two Bs. One, two, and then which gives you a nice lead up to the next chord which is a C it's like a build up so G's for two beats and then A minor for one and then G over B and then C so it's like the bass is going okay and I think that all straightforward and then you've got this little bit at the end where it goes to make you feel my and then a call per beat here so G B7 E minor G7 so G B7 first finger down the fourth string it's kind of like a D7 shape E minor and G7 get that first finger on that first fret first string Okay, let's go from the very start. Uh, see how much we can get on here. So if you're enjoying the content that I'm creating, please subscribe. It'll help me to keep making more videos. Okay. So G. One, two, three, four, G. D over F sharp.
sure you can agree that that is a absolutely amazing song great words great melody brilliant chords but quite quite simple chords as well but really well put together all right hope you enjoyed that thank you bye